like many small town 4th of July celebrations, there's a parade with sirens and patriots, a colorful clown with a welcoming message, the traditional kid candy scramble along the parade route, local manly events like the chainsaw contest, who can cut a log the fastest, and local clubs selling food. We are selling hot dogs, treats for sale. Come support Upper Country, Country 4-H. Here in Council, Idaho, population about 800, there is one event you will find nowhere else. It's the World Championship Porcupine Race. How do you catch a porcupine? Carefully. Okay, how do you race? Them? Carefully. <laughs> you take a broom and push them on. You not you can't even touch him. You just kind of haze him along. Old timers with much wisdom don't seem to say much about the event, so we found last year's winner, Taylor Kors, and asked him. What's the secret? There isn't a secret. Just let it go, and just wherever it goes, it goes. Tell me how you caught this year's porcupine. Uh, spotlights in the middle of the night out in the hayfield. Really? Yep. As race time approaches, the critters are auctioned off to the highest bidder. The money is split between the Chamber of Commerce and the top three finishers in the race. Here they go. It was obvious after the first heat that Winkler came to run. While he's cruising on the outside, the others are hunkered down, going nowhere. The final heat with the top three started slow, but once Winkler saw daylight, he decided to run. Race chairman, Lyle Saul. Finish as Winkler, sponsored by Heritage Festival, was first place. Drill bit, sponsored by Jerry's Auto Parts, was second. And Bolt, sponsored by Propel Electrics, third. That's the race. And one last note, in case you were wondering. We asked two-time world champion Maureen McIlvain about touching a porcupine. Can you pet a porcupine? Actually, Tony, the, uh, he catches them. We didn't have a garbage can one night when we were hunting them, and he puts his hand on the front of it and slides it down and grabs it by the tail. So, yeah. Get out of here. True story. And there you have it, believe it or not. From Council Idaho, scene of the world championship porcupine race, for the voice of Idaho agriculture, I'm Steve Ritter.